proud to be here in support of Darrell Douglas for City Council. The reason why I'm supporting Darrell is because I know him to be a strong young man of conviction. I saw his work with the Houston Justice Coalition. He was one of the reasons I believe that the city has body cams today. As a state legislator, I'm fighting for criminal justice reforms. A lot of those reforms were inspired from the work of Darrell Douglas and the Houston Justice Coalition. I filed a bill for special prosecutors. I believe in a civilian review, uh, a re review board. So Darrell Douglas has refreshing ideas. He has a strong work ethic and a solid commitment to this city. And it's with great pleasure and pride that I support Darrell Douglas for Houston City Council. Thank you very much. And the reason why I'm supporting Darrell Douglas is that I think Darrell can do the job that we need to be done at the City Hall. We just need the support that everybody get out and vote for him because he's already done great things in our community. He has set his mission, his goals, and his objectives. And we just need to support him and keep on supporting him because there are greater things for him to do. Thank you. I'm Betty Gregory. I'm with Tex Organizing Project. I met Darrell Douglas probably about six or seven years ago. I'm most proud of the fact that he did the work. He went into the prison system. He knows what's going on in the prison system. He did the work. He's not happy with what's going on in the prison system. He's not happy about the pipeline to prison program. He knows exactly what it takes and what to do on the outside to change that culture, and he's going to do that. I'm very, very proud of this young man, and he's going to do some things. Congratulations, Darrell. You know we love you, and keep on going. I'm running for city council because I've seen what happens when, our, when the people of our city come together and decide on a direction that we want to go, and the people who are elected listen. And I've also seen what happens when those who sit around the dais down the city hall ignore the voices of the people who pay taxes and who vote them into office. And so I want to be a voice for the people. I want to bring Houston City Council at large position five back to the people. For the past four years, my opponent, Dr. Jack Christie, has voted to allow Valero, a huge multi-billion dollar corporation, to get a $17 million tax break by unex, un, unannexing themselves from the city. While our roads are crumbling, while our schools are closing, we don't need elected officials who don't understand kitchen table issues here in the city of Houston.